So what does a drought resistant California look like? Uh, that's a question a lot of people want to know the answer to. A drought resistant California first of all has effective water markets so that in a drought period you can move water around the state in response to that drought and response to the needs of particular water consumers. Second, I think this is a really important point. A drought resilient California manages its groundwater effectively. It doesn't overdraft its groundwater aquifers during wet years so that there's less groundwater available when we really need it in the dry years. Third thing that I think is a key element of a drought resistant California is that water utilities and state water officials have engaged in very careful planning and have plans for exactly what they will do as a drought gets worse and worse. So that we don't end up just immediately jumping to desalination the moment that we have water scarcity. Or we don't immediately decide that what we have to do is to spend hundreds of millions of dollars building new surface reservoirs. But instead we recognize that in an early period of a drought, we can turn to conservation, then maybe to water reclamation. And only when a drought really becomes very serious do we turn to those ultimate fail-safe solutions of, for example, desalination. <laughs>